my background with music goes back really to when I was a kid. It, I was from a big family, so they had seven kids, my parents, and uh, we were all playing music growing up. So my, my two older sisters uh, were violinists. So that's when I came in and I was given a cello. But you know, when I got older and went to university and I spent time working abroad, I had been away from my cello living in Asia. The way things worked out, we, I moved to the, the west of Ireland. Um, we live in County Mayo on the west coast, a very beautiful part of the country. And like for everyone, my life really changed uh, earlier this year when uh, lockdown happened. So now I thought, you know, okay, this is this is a difficult time, but you know, I'm have more time to play music to myself, what I always want to do. So as the weather got nicer in in springtime, naturally I would do my practice outside, and I started to. Um, film some of it to share with my family and friends. So I thought of sharing it publicly. It has at times been overwhelming, but in a, in a warm hearted way, I almost expected uh, there to be a negative response. Someone telling me, you know, what you're doing is trivial. Uh, we have such important things happening in the world. That was not the response at all. It was the exact opposite. There, there does seem to be something that people are latching on to and, and getting enjoyment out of. I mean, certainly for Irish people who live around the world, there is a sense of maybe home or nostalgia for um, the beautiful landscape of Ireland, but also the music. Whatever it is that I'm doing, sharing this part of my life, uh, yeah, feeling really grateful that there is people that want to listen to something that I'm playing for no other reason than I love it.